Thank you for checking out this episode of Brutal Battle Beer Break. Today I'm going to be doing a beer by Gilgamesh Brewing. They're out of Salem, Oregon. And the beer I have today for them is Vader. It is a 6.5% ABV uh, Cascadian Dark Ale with coffee added. For those of you who don't know, Cascadian Dark Ale is also black IPAs. Anyway, so Vader, yes, and it looks like it has stars and everything. Could this be referring to Star Wars Vader? Most likely. All right, let's get this in the glass, see what it's looking like, tasting like. Very brown. Um, I was expecting maybe it would be a little bit more dark. Cascadian dark ales tend to be a little darker than this one is. This one's very, like, kind of, it looks dark brown, but when you hold it up to the light, it's pretty light brown, honestly, with a little tinge of a reddishness to it. Um, a lot of the times, Cascadian Dark Ales or Black IPAs will be significantly darker because of the dark malts that they use. So, I smell a lot of hops on it, to be honest. It's actually the first thing I get. Very citrusy, a little bit of a floral aspect to it. And as I keep smelling, I get that coffee coming through, but I'm also getting a chocolatey aspect from the darker malt. Which is really interesting, like hoppy, chocolatey citrus coffee it's real odd because you just keep you can't just i don't know like they just kind of like you smell those different smells in an order but the order changes every time i smell it. it's so like on some sniffs it's the coffee first on other sniffs it's the citrusy hoppiness first on others it's like the chocolate really interesting intricate There's a significant bitterness on the end for what I was expecting, which is probably from like that kind of dark, tannic kind of coffee uh, note to it. It's definitely like bitter coffee. Very roasty, heavy roast type coffee going on in there. There's a little bit of that citrusy hoppiness coming through. Not really getting, well, if I look for it, I can get like the slightest tinge of that chocolatey note, but really not much of anything there in that aspect. Um, it's kind of odd, to be honest. It's very bitter. It's a lot more bitter than I thought it would be. And it's just bitter like coffee that's not good, you know? Um, so, not really a fan of this one, got to be honest. I, I was hoping for a lot out of this, but maybe it's an instance where it gets better as it warms. The bitterness is just not so good. Um, sometimes bitterness is fine for me if it's backed up by a bunch of other flavors, but in this instance, it's, it's not backed up by enough because all the other flavors are very much subdued. Uh, in comparison to that bitterness. But anyway, Gilgamesh Brewing, sorry, it's, this is your only beer I've ever had. I didn't really care for it, but, you know, maybe I can find some of your stuff in the future, and I'm sure there's something good out there that I like. Anyway, thanks everyone for checking it out, and go get yourself an awesome beer.